Well, good morning. And um, we've come off the uh, Chertsey Camping and Caravan Club site this morning. We've travelled about 20 minutes, half yeah. an hour. Um, see Windsor Castle, that's on my bucket list. Yeah, and this is Sue's choice For again. Our anniversary. Yeah. We've um, we've had a little look on the internet and we found this coach park. It's Alexandra uh, Coach Park. And it's in a place called the Arches. Yeah, in Windsor. And it has uh, a space, a, a, an area for motorhomes. And Smurf, if I pop it's about, like that, you just about six, might isn't be able to see Smurf in the background there. Um, yeah, it's half a dozen. But I think if uh, at a push, you'd probably get more in there because you could. Um, you sat there, you're middle. not careful, takes you into Armour Road car park, which yeah. isn't really big enough. Yeah. So you've just got to carry on driving round and you'll find the Alexandra park yeah. right near it. I'll put so that little bit of footage over to the find. top. And um, while we're speaking, you might have seen that. Um, but that's a schoolboy error. If you turn right too soon. And you can stay overnight. Yeah, you can stay overnight in this one. Um, if you go on the app, there is a um, an overnight charge of about two, two or three quid. We're not quite sure, but um, and that's changeable, of course. So do check it out. Um, there is one van there that's got a block under his wheel, so he's clearly been there overnight. And then you can. Uh, we've just paid for up to five hours, and it was eleven pound fifty, wasn't it? Yeah. So it seems a bit steep, but you are in Windsor. You know, well, we paid that on bus here yesterday, didn't we? We did. Yeah. Not, not yeah. far off that. Yeah. So. It, it, and we've got it's, the dogs uh, near, it's so acceptable. It's much better. We're taking the dogs for a walk now into Windsor. Um, we don't think that dogs will be allowed in the castle, so we're going to give them a good walk, get them tired. It's a nice park just here. Um, we'll show you that in a second. And um, we can take them for a nice little walk, and then they'll go to sleep for two or three hours. And then when we come back, they'll have their dinner. So Smurf is over here. This is where we came in under the railway line here and um, the arches clearly the, ra the railway crossing just here and Sue's in front of me here Ooh, big gold. Uh, and then the coach park really big coach park and clearly these tourists are coming to see Windsor Castle the park over to the left here looks like it's got some amusements on at the moment so uh, we'll go and check that out with the dogs right now so we've come into this little park here, the car park's just the other side of the hedge, and there's the amusements. Nice little park for walking your dogs. Looks like there's a cricket club or something over there uh, behind those trees, but uh, let's have a wander around. We'll get head towards Windsor in this direction and see what we find. Well, we'll come to the other end of the Alexander Park. Um, which uh, and you see Alexandra Gardens actually, um, and we've uh, realised that this is all set up for Christmas, Look, for the Christmas the period. On the roof. And uh, we've got an ice rink right behind me here, and then there's a few, uh, lots of um, rides and a fairground really. Um, and uh, Sue's wanting to tell you about Santa. So they're setting this up by the looks of it. There's a windmill. And you've got Santa on the on the um, balcony and he's lay on the roof. That looks really, really pretty, doesn't it? Yeah, there's a lot of work going on here today, yeah. so clearly doing the decking. they're not open yet. There's uh, carpenters down there decking out, yeah. And uh, loads of engineers here setting up the ice rink, aren't they? Yeah, ready for lots of wind. It's lovely, lovely and um, when it's dark. Yeah. There's a nice bandstand over there, but it's all sort of amongst the, the um, uh, all, all the rides and things. So, this is where we are, and uh, we're along the River Thames there at Windsor. Well, we found a diamond jubilee fountain. This looks quite new. The gates are locked, so we're not sure how to get in, but we're having a little look from outside. And uh, Kent already noticed up here is Windsor Castle. Well, follow this footpath up the steps, which should take us to the castle. And there's a pub here. Looks very nice. Well, we just missed changing of the guard, which was about an hour ago. 
So there's some police and uh, um, road closures. But uh, this is the castle. And had we known, we might have got here a bit earlier. But never mind. There's a Christmas tree down there. Yeah. So here we are in Windsor. Uh, lovely buildings. And a Christmas tree that we saw in the distance. And we're still alongside the castle here. It's rather nice with the roads closed because uh, we've got uh, full access to sort of take pictures. And uh, there's a statue here of Queen Victoria, which I'll show you, next to the Christmas tree. We're walking down the middle of the road. Great, isn't it? And there she is, Queen Victoria, in the castle, standing proudly beside. Well, we've just taken the dogs back to the van, and tucked them up in bed, and we've walked through the coach park here, and. Once you get to the end of the coach park, at this end there are toilets, there's a few shops, and then you can come up the stairs to, through this walkway and through the station to Windsor. Just an alternative way, in our opinion, it's not nearly as pretty as the park. The parks are through there. But we're going to carry on to the castle again, which is in front of us. Well, we've come into the station now, and uh, there's something rather nice over here for you train lovers. The Queen. There's a coat of arms on there. So as you come out of the station, Lots of eating places and uh, shopping. Waitrose just over here and uh, a shopping centre. It's very quiet, isn't it, sir? Yeah. yeah, but it's midweek and uh, so that's probably why. Yeah, really. Well, we're just looking at the uh, like a trading centre here, the, the old uh, like corn exchange type thing. There's a wonky house. How yeah, wonky that is! I don't pick that up in camera. It's across the road. Gardens and uh, a Christmas fair. I think probably Sue will want to have a quick look in there. There's a wonky house. Taking the dogs back, we just had a coffee and we've been to a little artisan market. Oh, yeah, been in a room 
Camilla and Prince Charles got married. We, by chance, went to a Christmas fair. We did, the artisan fair. We're out, outside Win, Windsor Castle now and we're going to go inside. Armed guard on the gate there, look. So here's the entrance, we're going to get tickets and go into Windsor Castle. Well, we're inside the castle grounds now and uh, there's a, a robotic lawnmower and Sue is saying, this, Sue says it's not cutting the grass very well. walking through the little internal roads and uh, so it's just picturing one of these lookout points that uh, <laughs> imagine them watching you and uh, there's the moat room Wow, there's so much to see here. And it's just so beautiful. Yes. down here at the guard room and the guard is marching up and down We're on the north side of the castle here now, and there's a cannon.
we've just been in the chapel, haven't we? Yes, and then we've been around the state apartments. State apartments? Yeah, what do you think of the chapel? We can't take any photos. That was, that was fabulous. We paid our respects to the Queen, didn't we? We saw her resting place. We saw place. where her resting place yeah. is. So with, that's the most uh, important thing we've With seen, Prince really. Philip. Yeah. yeah, no photographs to be taken in any of the state rooms or no. the chapel, and we respectfully removed our like hats. Took, took about 100 pictures. Yeah, you're not allowed to take pictures inside though, are you? No, um, so much to see. So there is, that, it's, you can't explain it. Look on the website, Windsor Castle. Um, you'll see all the official pictures and photographs that we've seen. I think my favourite was that clock with the etching and, yeah. the, and the windows. Yeah, I mean there's so many pieces yeah. in there. The doll's house. Oh, oh yes, and the doll's house. Mm -hmm. Absolutely fabulous. And the state rooms, I mean the big tables mm. um, where all the, um, the foreign the IPs. 56 chairs on canvas. Did you really? In the, in the big grand hall. Yeah. Yeah. It is incredible. We, we can't show you on the, our video, but do check it out. And if you're in Windsor, if you you're not allowed to bring your dogs in, and that's quite obvious, really, why. But um, this is really worth a look. What did we pay to come in? Just around about 50 pounds, wasn't it, yeah, for the two of us? Yeah. And and this is a, a day out that you shouldn't miss yeah. if you're in the area. Come on then, we've got to go and look at some more. Some more to look at. I'll show you across the lawns here where many of the um, events have taken place on the lawns here at Windsor Castle. Well, here we are. This is um, where many of the events took place, particularly during COVID, out here on the lawns. And the guard. Pretty amazing, wasn't it? Mm. And very moving. Mm. And um, we're now going to have a look around a few shops and make our way back to the van.